at the sky fall I couldn't fight it I hope I see your face And that you'd be reminded that for me It isn't over I can't help feeling We could have had it all I wish nothing but the best For you to Let it crumble Stand tall and face it off together. Ah, 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 ah. I was really hoping that this makeup would like give me really good Adele singing abilities, but it doesn't. Hey guys, it's Holly and welcome back to my channel. Today I am super excited because the day that this video goes up, I am going to the Adele concert. I have never seen Adele live and I've always wanted to. Although I feel like it will be a very different vibe to like most concerts because there's no mosh pit and she's not really a party kind of singer. It's more of like all these really amazing sad and depressing ballads which get me right in the feels. I love Adele and I'm a very big Adele fan and I feel like... I might be wrong, but I kind of feel like I look like a mini, like a younger version of Adele because we've got similar face structure, similar hair colour, that's about it. We definitely don't have similar talents. I can't sing like her. I try. <laughs> but I can't. My favourite song of hers is All I Ask. So since I'm going to a concert that inspired me to make this a get the look celebrity inspired Adele makeup. So I want to do more celebrity inspired things. So comment down below a celebrity that I look somewhat like. I know I don't look exactly like anyone but like you know like some blonde celebrities that I could somehow pass for and I will do a makeup tutorial on them. I really hope you guys enjoy this video and if you like Adele make sure you give this video a big thumbs up even if you don't like Adele. Just give this video a big thumbs up. And let's get into it. Starting with my Maybelline Baby Skin Primer, I'm just going to prime my face. I'm then going to be mixing these two together. This is the Balm Balm Shelter Tinted Moisturizer and this is the Stay Matte Rimmel London Foundation. I'm then taking my Naked Skin Open Decay Concealer, which I am loving, and I'm just going to apply this under my eyes to brighten up my eyes and kind of use this as a highlighter as well as fixing up all my blemishes. Adele's face is very matte, which is why I'm using concealer as a highlighter rather than highlighting powder, which is usually shimmery, just to ensure that like we get that really beautiful matte, flawless look. To completely mattify my face, I'm just going to be using my Rimmel London Stay Matte Powder. Now using my Australis Contour Palette, I'm going to be taking the banana shade here and use that to bake underneath my eyes. And while that sets in place, I'm then going to be taking this first shade down here and I'm going to be applying this to my cheekbones to really chisel out my cheekbones and contour them because Adele has amazing cheekbones. Um, I've got quite prominent like of my cheeks which is what she's got um, just like times 10. I'm gonna try and like chisel out her cheekbones on my cheeks and see if I can do it. <laughs> I'm just brushing in that banana powder. I'm now taking this color here from the same palette and I'm just gonna go over it just because this is a little bit more natural toned and a little bit orange so hopefully this will make it look a little bit natural. And then I'm going to be taking this lighter shade up here, which is slightly pink toned, a little bit like a blush, but still quite a prominent contour colour. I'm just going to run that just above when my bronzer is, just to add a little bit of warmth. However, Adele does not look like she's wearing any blush at all, so this will just add a little bit of warmth without putting like too much blush on. Her nose is also very contoured, so I'm going to take an eyeshadow brush. Um, just be in mind, I'm very bad at contouring noses, so I'm going to try my best. Um, and I'm just going to take this uh, colour here that we used first, and I'm just going to use this petal brush here and just kind of like draw around where the contour lines should go, and then I'll blend that in. I 
Adele's eyebrows are a little bit thinner and darker than my eyebrows are, so I'm going to be taking the middle color from this same palette, and I'm just going to be using this petal brush again, and I'm just going to kind of like draw her eyebrows and what they look like, and then fill them in. She's got like a slight arch, like a curved arch though, not like a pointy one. So that's kind of the shape of her eyebrows. Of course, they're not like perfect because I'm doing them on my eyebrows, which are a little bit different. Um, but I'm quite happy with how that is looking. So now I'm just going to take my normal brow kit from L'Oreal and just go over those to get the natural color that I usually do my eyebrows in, as well as her color, which is already like the base. This is not making any sense. Then I'm just going to go over that line that we just created with the darker color. And then just to set my brows in place, I am just using my Australis Tint My Brow Brow Tint. Now for my favourite part, the eyes. I'm going to start by priming my eyes with my Urban Decay Primer Potion. All of the colours that Adele uses in her eyes are very bronzy and brown. It's kind of like a soft brown eye. And so to achieve this, I'm going to be using my Naked One palette, which is full of all these beautiful brown colours. So I'm going to start with probably my favourite colour on this palette, which is this colour here called Buck. I'm just going to start by putting that gently into my crease. Onto my lid, I'm just going to be taking the colour Naked, which is just a lighter matte brown colour. To add in some bronze, I'm going to be taking this beautiful kind of like dark bronzy shimmery colour called Smog, and I'm just going to put that onto the outer part of my lid and into my crease. Now I'm just going to be taking this shimmery light colour called Virgin, which is the lightest colour on the palette, and I'm just going to be putting that in the inner corner and on the first part of my lid. To line my lower lash line, I'm just going to be using the colour Buck, which is the first brown colour that we used, and I'm just going to line my lower lash line. Adele has a quite strong and thick winged black liner, so I'm just going to do that. I just bought a new eyeliner, but I don't know where I put it, so I'm going to be using the Balm Schwing eyeliner, um, but I'm pretty sure this is pretty much run out, so I'm hoping I can get a good strong wing out of it, otherwise I might have to improvise with some eyeshadow. <laughs> And now I'm going to be applying my Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara and I'm just going to be applying this all over my lashes. She's wearing fake lashes in this photo. I don't have any fake lashes with me at the moment, they're all in storage. So I'm just going to be using a lot of mascara instead. Now onto the lips. I don't really have any lip colours that are similar to the one she is wearing. She's wearing like a very much like brownie nude colour. Um, and I've got ones that are a little bit more red. Um, so I'm literally just going to play around with a few different colours to see if I can get this really pretty glossy lipstick that she is wearing. So I'm going to start by applying my Caramel Lip and Cheek Tint from the How About Them Apples palette from the Balm. And I'm just going to apply this firstly to my lips. Next I am going to be putting on my Maybelline Colour Sensational Lipstick in Tauntalizing Taupe. And this is a bit more of a matte kind of brown colour. And then to darken it up further, I'm using this kind of like dusty rose type colour from MAC, which is the Satin Viva Glam 2 in A75, which I love. And so I'm just going to apply that on top. Yeah, that's not too bad. It's not exact, but like it's pretty close. Thank you guys so much for watching, I really hope you enjoyed my Adele Inspired Celebrity Makeup Tutorial. I am super stoked with how it came out. I really hope you guys liked this video and don't forget to comment down any other celebrities I should do some celebrity inspired makeup tutorials on um, because I love doing these and I want to do more. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll hopefully be doing a get ready with me for the Adele concert um, if everything goes to plan that will be filmed as well. So watch out for that one. Smile, be safe, and stay beautiful, guys, and I'll see you in my next video. 